Hello students, in today's video we shall learn how to represent square root of 10 on the number line. For this you would need a scale and a compass. First draw a number line. So just draw a straight line like this using a scale and then mark a point O representing 0. So let's say this is 0 and this arrows we put here. Take a point A on the number line such that OA is equal to 4 units. So you can take any measurement for this. I am taking this much and to cut 4 arcs. So from here if I take 1, 2, 3, 4. It's just touching this end. So this is 1. 2, 3 and you can just extend this little bit more so that the 4 fits in here. Okay, at this point I represent A. So OA is 3 units. At point A we will construct a perpendicular. So we will draw an arc like this. Now from this point, keep the metal point here, this is 60 degrees angle and at this point you keep the metal point, this is 120 degrees and here we put one more arc, so we will have two intersecting arcs here. Now join these two points. Now this is 90 degrees angle. Take one unit measurement Cut an arc from A such that this is one unit Label this as point B So this is one unit Join O B Now this length here is square root of 10. Measure OB using compass and draw an arc on the number line at point C and that will be your square root of 10. This is OB measurement and we will draw an arc cutting at the number line. This point here is C and this represents square root of 10. Now we shall prove this using Pythagoras theorem. OB squared is equal to OA squared plus AB squared. OA is 3 units so 3 squared plus 1 squared it is 9 plus 1 which is equal to 10. So OB squared is equal to 10 or we can say OB is equal to square root of 10. So if this is square root of 10 we take this as the radius this is also square root of 10 this distance from O to C. OC is also equal to square root of I hope this is clear to all. Thank you.